Mesa Pills 2013 A180 model. So there's a customer complaint about the uh, engine light on and uh, coolant temperature showing uh, like abnormal. Like it's like first weight uh, around 80 to 90. So it's not get warmer quicker. So we shut in our hotel ultra uh, tester and and it's come with the full code P012800. The engine coolant temperature is below the coolant thermostat set temperature. So first, uh, we'll use the intelligent intelligent test plan for the hotel. Uh, the the full code. So that's a technical service pool team. So okay, we can go through that as well. So in just a, so there's a yeah. So engine does not heat up operating temperature and driving point between the wide open total and hang refrigeration line and engine trim to cover. Engine diagnosing warning lamp activate full code. P zero one two eight. So we'll grab the second one. Uh, engine does not heat up operating temperature. So technical service bolting. Complain engine does not heat up and engine malfunction light on may know with possible full code P0128. The coolant temperature is below the coolant thermostat speci specified temperature. Storing engine control unit cause various cause. So, remedy. Check software is engine control is update if necessary. If this complaint still exit or vehicle return with the same complaint, drain the coolant, check the condition of the coolant and take photos. Throw the flush the coolant system. It is essential for flush the heater cooler in both direction. Remove coolant thermostat. Replace coolant thermostat. So most important thing is to check the there's any engine control update, software update. If not, we have to check the condition of the coolant and the 
and other things most importantly uh, function of the map control thermostat so sometimes we'll check the third one as well So this one, engine will run and the fault code P0128, same fault code. Cause is after engine start, after engine start, engine coolant boom up more slowly than they specified in curve store in the engine control unit. Yeah, so that's exactly what happened with this, uh, this vehicle. Remedy check, component R, 48 coolant thermostat heat heating elements so and uh, if the con if the component r48 coolant thermostat heating element is not okay the coolant system must be checked for silica uh, contamination to do this process as follows open cap coolant expansion reservoir and release the pressure in engine cooling system Yeah, so after engine start, engine coolant warm up more slowly than the specific in curve store in the engine control unit. So remedy, check the component R48, coolant thermostat heating element. If the coolant component R48 coolant thermostat heating element is not okay, the coolant system must be checked for the silica contamination to this to do this first as follows open the cap on coolant expansion reservoir and release the pressure in the engine cooling system close the cap again remove the lower engine compartment panel completely drain the coolant we are drain screw on radiator close off the coolant hose between the expansion reservoir and radiator using the suitable tool or clamp disconnect the coolant hose from the radiator check the coolant hose select information are connection to the radiator plus the heater heat, uh, heater heat exchanger plus the heater exchanger so that he can the following duration of at least four liters of clean water then during this keep the turning the water supply on off pinch of hose providing the plus rating plus of the water Throw the flush out heater heat exchange is followed direction with the this 40 liters of the clean water so this all about the uh, flushing the engine cooling system after lodging of component must be replaced coolant thermostat expansion reservoir radiator oil water heat exchanger, electric coolant pump engine, electric circular pump and switch over valve. So yeah, so before replacing, anyway I'm going to replace the coolant thermostat. So before replacing those other parts, so we have to, we have to check the coolant and confirm so there's any silica con contamination is present or not. So before that, so we'll do test for the uh, uh, heat element on thermostat so so I'll for, before that I'll check the live data on uh, temperature sensor
thermal management system yep. so coolant temperature showing showing 17.24 celsius But the range given is 75 to 110. Okay, so engine not engine not is warm, so We'll do the component test. We'll do a tube test. engine light on and you can see coolant temperature coolant temperature between 75 degrees to 110 degrees so current value is 70 76.5 so before you show it it so before what happened is uh, uh engine not getting uh quite warmer so so it's before that like below 65 so before before was the the faulty thermostat was uh before mm, below 75 celsius so that's why I always getting the engine light on with the with the full coat coolant full temperature full coat but now you can see so temperature is moving to the 90 degrees so there's no any fluctuation no any fluctuation or anything so maybe we have to do the road test also long test long test drive to make sure everything is okay
so seventy nine. Okay guys, thank you very much for watching our YouTube channel. So we will we will meet next time with the new video. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Oh, 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 oh,